In the 1990s, the world was introduced to the first iteration of the web. Web 1.0 offered web pages for users to consume, but didn't give them a way to create. By the 2000s, the web had evolved. Web 2.0 gave users more creative control, but increased their dependence on third-party platforms to host their data, resulting in weakened data privacy and security. Because of this, we began asking how we could own our data and reliably prove who we are, without relying on third-party platforms. Today, we are entering a new era of the web. This is Web3. With Web3's features of decentralization and blockchain technology, we can finally have complete control over our data and identities. EBSI was born with Web3 in mind. Our goals were to build a decentralized infrastructure for verifying citizens' information, create blockchain-based public services, and ensure trust online by preserving user privacy. To do this, we built EBSI's foundation around the use of digital wallets, verifiable credentials, and blockchain infrastructure. So, you may be asking, what exactly is EBSI today? In short, it's the first public sector blockchain services infrastructure in Europe. EBSI consists of a solid and energy-efficient permission blockchain network with more than 40 node operators across the continent. Already, more than 21 pilot projects from 18 countries have been developed using EBSI, and 11 universities from 11 countries have delivered on cross-border pilot projects. More than 15 providers have made EBSI conformant digital wallets, which will support users in storing and sharing their verifiable credentials. And more than 170 organizations have expressed interest in partnering with EBSI in 2023. We are EBSI. We help citizens study, live, and grow all over Europe. We make information easy to verify and almost impossible to fake. Together, we reimagine mobility in Europe. If you're interested in helping build EBSI with us, check out the Early Adopters Programme. For all other information, please visit our website at ebsi.eu.